welcome back to Press X for Chromosomes, where I, th I think I just go f yeah, forward. Yeah? Follow this around, and there should be someone. Hopefully, they'll be glowing green. Yeah, oh, there they are. Yeah. Thank God. Hello. Hello, Ishiki. It's rare to see outsiders in the city. He's going well, to speak. I also think it's rare for you guys to speak perfect uh, English. Cool. Yep. I like him. You've seen other outsiders. Only one. He was handsome, gentle, and kind. We were in love, but our love is forbidden. Did he die? Outlawed by the cult of Kukulkan. That's awful. I'm sorry. So he was sentenced to death, tied to the cliffs, and left. To oh my God! Just because you love somebody? I welcome death. That's when he found me, the outsider. He freed me and treated my wounds. Who was he? I don't know his name. It's been many years, but I still hope to see him again. I often return to the cliffs near the condor nests and collect their feathers. They remind me of him. That's a remarkable story. Thank you for trusting me with it. Thank you for Are we gonna meet this outsider at one point, maybe? Yeah. Be like, hey, remember the girl that you pulled down from remember, the cliffs? And he's safe. gonna be like, yeah, I love her. I don't know where she is. And you just be like, secrets Poof. revealed. Oh, just where another condor nest is? That's what she was talking about. Oh, that's where so they that's fucking hung her up. Oh, fucking jerks. So we need to go to the right. Did I, didn't I come from there? I think maybe up here. Yeah, don't mind me, Mister. Hey, <laughs> don't be my fucking way, idiot! No, <laughs> is it you? I think so. You weren't talking. Talkable Talk last time. Yeah. yeah. Peace goes at me. Ah, did he? Did you say you were cast out for lying? No, Ishiki. I was cast out for telling the truth. That was my mistake. What happened? Man. Should I say their their judiciary outside? system's about as <laughs> fucked up as ours? <laughs> right. What, well, what outsiders? They dress in black and have strange weapons. They hide gold. I told the cult about the gold and the outsiders. They cast me out for lying. Lying? The gold was for them. One day, the cult will be exposed for its hypocrisy. So what do you do now? I lost everything, Ishiki. My position, power, reputation. But it took me losing all that to finally see. I had no purpose, no calling. And you found one? Yes. I served the future by protecting the past. Queen Unuratu's line are the rightful rulers of Paititi, not the cult of Kukulkan. Everything I see, everything I hear, everything I know, now helps the rebellion. A worthy cause. I send people to steal the gold shipments the outsiders deliver from time to time. They never change the drop-off point. Sounds like you're making a difference in a lot of people's lives. Thank you for sharing. It was nice talking with you. You too, Ishiki. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for telling me where gold is. I'm glad I'm getting fucking like little minor rewards Wait, for this shit. Did we already get that gold though? No. Okay. I'm assuming since it just showed up, probably didn't what didn't exist till now. Dude, I go that back cliff. In the, water. the cliff. That cliff that we were trying to jump to. Maybe there'll be like an actual way to get over there now. Yeah. How did I get up there the first time? Um, was that through that fucking cave that was just up here? No, it was through a. Uh, it was in a house. It was a well, and we jumped into it. It was over here, because we were following the uh, monolith. Okay. And then we jumped into that body of water that's right to your left. Hold on, I'm gonna. Okay, no, no, he's definitely in here. <laughs> they, whomever. This is probably the fucking quest to be like, hey, there's a secret tomb nearby. <laughs> you know Meanwhile, what? I was just like, can I jump in here? <laughs> they didn't count on us just like not doing anything but explore. There's this too. Well, I'm not sure what that's for. Like, we can't seem to get into it. Yeah, there's like, it doesn't even tell us missing gear. Like, I don't know how to get up there. I don't see him anywhere nearby too. Hmm. <laughs> sure. It just seems that we can make that jump with how close she gets to it. 
Yeah. Nose? I don't know. I also don't see, like, it going anywhere. It seems like there's a wall back there. So I don't know if it's just something to look like it can get there. Are we in a, Are we in the circle? We should be. We're at the very edges of it. It's somewhere around. It's not in any further. I know that much. But where? I don't know. Nope. There's no other pathway up to that. And there's no I just I'm very confused about this too. Yeah. I feel like I should be able to get in there. But now we're outside. Right. Cause this is where the tomb is, right here. Right. Oh, this goes to, like, this place. I wonder if we are going to be able to get in here at some point. Yeah, because otherwise why would it be on the map? Yeah, exactly. But isn't this, like, the house? Mm-hmm. Where the fuck? <laughs> Is that what a pathway to, to so to the left of the uh, up more and to the right? This one that could you maybe? I don't know get how. To, to be fair, I've been kind of blinded by the fucking thing that lights up. Uh, fair. I'm just trying to see if there's any other pathways to it. I, I'm like. Very skeptical if he's in here. No, that's fair. It's just the only are are these anything? I feel like there's something. They're everywhere, but they're maybe they're just absolutely everywhere. I can't really get up there. Okay. And she's not like gonna hook to anything either. Mm hmm. Hmm. Might leave this one and come back. It's Fucking just so good. frustrating because she gets so close to it. Yeah, but that's that's the reason why I'm like maybe it doesn't actually go anywhere. So that kind of weirdly leads me to believe that that weird like ledge up there. He might be up there. Yeah. I wonder if that fucking ledge goes to fucking this ledge. Maybe. You know. I'm just trying to... Can you walk onto the the thatch at all? The thatch? I don't think it can. No? Okay. Yeah. I mean, that is a flat texture, too. Oh! To your right, there's some rock. That's where we got the thing. That didn't oh, go anywhere. Oh, okay. Yeah. And there's that thing up there. Right. But no, I don't think that's it climbable. Does, it doesn't look like it is. Isn't there something I can just fucking like? No. Okay, well I'm gonna go look for the other person at this rate. Yeah. Just to fucking continue, so they're over here. Maybe we have to push the guard around a little bit. Push the guard. around. Yeah, and he'll just chuck us. I don't know. <laughs> That's kind of like over to the left a little bit, right? I thought that was like a trap door for a second, like the bundle of hardwood. I was like, what the fuck is under there? I kind of did too, honestly. Hello. Are you an outcast? Yes, you How can you tell? Hello. I know, right? I is there not anything Cabrera. different? Oh, not just one. There are many of them. Kisco sent me to speak to all those who are cast out. You're a hunter. I am now. I was once a farmer, but that wasn't a life for me. I felt trapped. Forced to live up to the duties and expectations brought down by my family. I finally refused and went my own way. 
And a white capybara was responsible. No, Ishiki. They heard of them. One night they assaulted my field. Trampled everything, but I did nothing to stop them. I just watched. They gave me an idea. They heard of these capybara. All right, what if I could hunt them? What if I could finally get away from the fields? So you did it. Best decision I ever made. My father disowned me, gave the farm to my sister, but that's fine with me. I'm a hunter now. They call me Paimo the White. <laughs> Thank you for the entertaining story, Paimo. Thank you, Ishiki. Show me on my map. <laughs> Where are the white capybaras? So we can kill them and take their... Uh... There we go. I have to hit the map button, I think. That's where some capybaras are. Cool. Fucking neat. Uh, and the last dude. I'm just like, that's wait, right. We, that wasn't even on the fucking map. What? The fifth person. Yeah, I don't know if we're supposed to find all four first. And then the fifth one shows up? Yeah, or if like we need to talk back to what's his face. Pet I don't think we've talked to her. Ooh, can oh, we pet these? Chiki? Beautiful animals, aren't they? Llamas? So gentle. Even the wild guanaco in the wilderness. They love to be petted. But God Maybe I should not fucking <laughs> shoot them. Hey, they just left. That's true. They did just leave. They you could not really kill it. Okay, I am going to look kind of up on this cliff because there sh should be a way to get up. I may just be approaching it way too closely. Did we ever go in that lower cave? This one right here? No. Yeah. We could. I think this might have been where we came from, though. Maybe not. Do we only have one point? Yeah. That's why I went, hmm, and then left. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're actually... Hold on, dude. I'm going to steal your shit first. Is he in the circle? Yeah, he... Well, he's... Green. Unaratu approached. Damn it. Yep. All right. Well, I had literally just pulled up a guide to uh, figure out where the fuck they were. <laughs> the outcasts. Yes, Ishiki. I'm Jessica. I'm Lara. Pisco sent me. Pisco the dead? Sent you to me? Did you lose a game of Patoli? No. A boy Taki lost his dice. I'm trying to win them back for him. Pisco wanted me to talk to all those who've been cast out before he gives them back to me. I'm surprised he didn't try to play you for them. He is. Probably because we wouldn't understand uh, the game. Well, all I can tell you is this. Like Pisco, I was cast out. I lost my job and my position. But not because of an accident. Because of something I did and would do again. What happened? Do you have any children? No. Neither do I. I did not receive the blessing of Ishel. But for my mistress, I was the midwife for her three children. I loved them like they were my own until I lost my position. What did you do? I'm a thief, Lara. What did you steal? A jade necklace. Why? The youngest, Kiara. She saw the necklace while visiting a friend. She took it. They were coming for her. They would have cast her out. She was an only child. I said I took it. My mistress took the necklace from me and threw it on the floor, breaking it. And cast me out instead. I'm so sorry. Don't be sad for me. I would do it again. Kiara's learned her lesson, and she has a good life. As for me, I serve Ishel now through my weaving, the way my mother taught me. And my Kiara comes to visit me sometimes. Thank you for sharing that, Chaska. Kiara was lucky to have you. Be well, Ishiki. So do we get a, sec a secret from her now? <laughs> a jade over here. Nice. And they gave us another circle. Yeah. After. That's what I was thinking was going to happen. Because I was like, <laughs> there's no way. Also, is there anywhere else to go in here? No, no, no. no? It's just her den. She's still green. Yeah. 
She's secretly Shrek, Shrek or Fiona. <laughs> right. All right. Time to fucking go all the way over here. Is the kid cast out? Yoink. <laughs> I didn't actually yoink it. <laughs> yoink. Didn't we steal her meat already? Uh, I think it was a different person. Was it? Okay. Yeah. This dude? No. Oh, that's right. He, we've been able to talk to him. Oh, they're clear now. Oh, shit. Too much time has passed. Perhaps. I don't know. Excuse Dude, me. If you wouldn't have turned so suddenly and cut us off, we wouldn't have shoved into you. I passed the circle. Okay. There's too many, like, areas I could be. Didn't see it there. So go back up the stairs. Yep, there we go. Nice. I think we have a visitor. Yeah, you do. Hi. Hello. Hello. Grandma. You're Lara, aren't you? Uh, Pisco sent you. <laughs> he did. I'm Moreka. That was the second time I heard your name today, Lara. The cultists are talking about you. You're well, <laughs> I'm irresistible. Sensi, the one who found the key of Shakshe. I am. Oh, don't feel bad, child. The cleansing was long overdue. It must be decided. Do we continue or begin again? That's not an easy decision. I mean, at this point, night? begin again. This <laughs> right. The fate of the world is not easy. I like this one. Thank you. You're right, Lara. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. I don't take this stuff really lightly. <laughs> <laughs> they will enslave us all and call it protection. Won't they, Remak? <laughs> he doesn't talk much. Because he's fucking cold. jamming out, dude. <laughs> Leave him alone. Fear of, what? fear of the outside. Fear of change. Fear of the gaze. The threats that are outside are in all of us. Fear is the enemy, not change. Change is the only constant. But look at me rambling on, Dreamac. The lady must want to buy something to help in her search. I got, uh, oh my god, she has guns? She's a merchant. I'm kind of poor, lady. Thank yeah, you, Yeah, we are. Laser sight. That's nice. For all rifles. Crimson Hunt. She increases for experience. Nice. Nice. The Ascender. It's like, and the walk back. Come find me. Because I'll come back. Yeah, no, don't worry. You have <laughs> the things we will. Looking for. We'll just we just <sighs> need to advance the plot so we can start getting gold and jade hand over fist. Now go back to homie. I used to know relatively where he's at. Yeah, he's at the top. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In the fucking dance hut. Yeah. See, we're starting to learn the city. <laughs> <laughs> like one portion of it. Yeah. I have. But you still don't see it. They all had hope. You need to do better than that if you want to win the game, Lara. Hope is one thing, but all those who have been cast out have thrived in their new lives despite their circumstances. Even you, Pisco. Well, I am the best Batoli player Paititi has ever known. <laughs> Not bad for a dead man. <laughs> Not bad at all. So again, what did you learn? I learned that sacrifice... Thank God I don't have to actually answer this, because it's like, I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't 100% paying attention. <laughs> to the morals, at least, of their Love tales. Than death, and you need to believe in something greater than yourself. But ultimately, you can't control everything. It's what you make of your situation. Like, three of them <clears throat> had about the well, same story, but the first dude and the I'm last sure lady had... <laughs> Something that was pretty different than those three, so yeah. It is not the throw of the dice that wins the game; it's the skill of the player. I see that now. What did you think of Moreka, the outcast? She was. Oh, she was neat. Expecting me. She yeah. had a bunch of guns I needed. <laughs> now I know I'm not gonna just get it by fucking quest line. I gotta Which... fucking buy it. I want rewards. <laughs> I saw. You were lucky. You found her. 
She often travels outside of Paititi, gathering inventory. She seemed the most optimistic. Of course she is. We have a saying in Paititi. We all create destiny. We don't choose our circumstances, only our actions. A lesson my friend Taki needs to learn. Well played. Thank you, Pisco. I'll bring the dice back to Taki. And teach him a lesson by keeping the dice. God. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now we got two skills. Yeah, I'm starting to get to the point where I need three. three. Which is fucking irritating, but Which, whatever. Like they, they fucking really take a long time to dole them out. So it's like Bruh. We're like what, thirty percent of the way through the game though? Yeah. I think, yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. And that's fucking based off of side quest slash like completion of items probably. Yeah, and little fucking considering the Mass Effect run I did for uh the insanity uh -huh. for you. 54% after beating it. Because I did none of the side quests. I didn't do shit. <laughs> yeah, fuck him, honestly. I mean, I was high enough level. I just needed to play a little bit smart. And once I started getting my powers and started and got, like, a suit that fits my play style, mm -hmm. I just tore through everybody. Kid, I'm back. <laughs> He's like, oh my god. Now I'm playing a Vanguard and just zipping around the map because it's fun. fun. Isn't it? That's why I always played as a Vanguard. <laughs> According to him, you wanted to play a game and you lost. He wouldn't let me play a game. Just one more roll and I would have won. Kisco wanted you to know. It's not the throw of the dice that wins the game. It's the skill of the player. Now that I have my dice back, I can practice more. Thanks again, Ishiki. You didn't learn anything, you little shithead. Whatever. You got, got 250 money gold? I got money for it, yeah. Oh, and there's a, there is that jade that's north. There's a lot of things that's so you fucking... Could get, you could get 600 monies. There's a, yeah. <laughs> there's a lot of things that's around. There's that J. There's fucking thing. There's this gold right here. There's fucking condor feathers. I can watch where she almost fucking got murdered. I can just kill a bunch of capybaras. And there's a mural out there. Yeah. I don't know if it's taking me this way. I don't know how to get over here. I don't either. But Maybe I can go swim? this way. Maybe... Yeah, I don't know. Moral story is, yeah. this is a good place to stop regardless. So we'll catch you guys on the next episode of... We might do a quest mission, just to... Push just things. to open up the map a little bit more. Yeah, because I'm not sure. <laughs> also, just to... F I'll, I'll come back to this area and do some of those quests, like those little challenge objects. By myself, yeah. If anything, because they're they're pretty fucking pointless for being like, "Hey guys, here here they are." <laughs> watch it, watch a different guide for that. <laughs> we ain't we ain't one hundred percenting. I mean, I am. You I'm just fucking not yourself. gonna do it on camera, yeah. yeah. Cause it's just oh my god, a lot of I can't, running around. I can't say it's gonna be fucking entertaining. <laughs> so that's why I just like fuck it. I'm gonna do it by myself. I feel like I'm barely entertaining whatsoever. Well, like the fact that we've been like running around the fucking map, <laughs> lot, just doing like, sh like bullshit. Yeah, I'm just like God, like <laughs> fucking. I know this is probably boring for everyone. But moral of the story is we'll stop here. So we'll catch you guys in the next episode of Progressing the Plot. So Hell until yeah. then, bye. bye.